Hi there. I am representing WebTrackOfficial.com. We provide all sorts of digital marketing solutions like web designing, social media integration, search engine optimization, graphic designing and logo designing. So if you want any services from us, contact us at support at WebTrackOfficial.com. In this video I am going to show you, how you can fix the white screen issue in WordPress. It is also known as white screen of death. The white screen of death is one of the most infamous and cryptic errors in WordPress. This error simply replaces your entire site with a blank, white nothing, leaving no error messages or further assistance. This problem can occur for a variety of reasons and usually means your site couldn't be loaded properly. So you can try these troubleshooting methods to fix it. The most common cause of SOT is a faulty plugin. So from your cPanel, click on public HTML. Now click on WP content. Now here you will see a plugins folder. Inside that folder, there will be all your plugin folders that were currently installed on your site, before the error. Now to check if this is a, even a plugin issue or something else, rename the plugins folder to anything you wish. When you rename it, it will disable all the plugins on your site. Now refresh the page and see if the white screen disappears, if it does, first rename the folder back to plugins. Open the plugins folder. And rename the folder one by one, and refresh the page to check if it works. I am sure that it will work, but if by any chance it don't, follow me with second step. Your theme can also cause this issue. So to make sure, rename the themes folder to anything you want. Now refresh and see. If the white screen disappear, then it's your theme's fault. Now to activate a new theme, first rename the folder to its original state. You need to upload it from here. Debug mode is a useful feature that lets you see errors directly on each page, which can help you pinpoint the underlying cause of the sod. So to enable it, from your cPanel, right-click on WP config file, and click edit. Now scroll down. Now instead of false, change it to true. Save it. Now you can directly see the error messages on your page and solve the issue. Now to purge cache, you need to access your dashboard, but it's not possible to access your dashboard with sod error. So to do it, just follow me, if you're using WP Optimize plugin on your site, in the URL bar, add this line and hit enter. It will purge all the cache on your site and solve your issue, if you're using any other plugin for optimizing your site, you can check the relevant blog on the internet. Your site might have run out of memory. You can raise your maximum limit by editing your WP config file. Now just right click and click edit. Scroll down to the end and paste this line of code, just before the happy blogging line. Paste the code. This code tells WordPress to increase the PHP memory limit. These methods will fix the facade in the vast majority of cases. However, if you're still experiencing issues, you should contact your hosting provider's support team for more help. If this video helped you in any way, like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you later, alligator.